Hello, Leo. How are you doing? Welcome to your reading. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. So let's just hop right into it, my loves. Please be sure to like this video to show your love and your support for this channel. I truly do appreciate it. So let's what's coming towards Leo and love. Ooh, well, dang. <laughs> Spirit has a message for the Leo. So Leo, you have husband, love letter, strength and courage, engagement. So some of you, this could be your husband or someone who could be your husband, you know, in the future or something like that. Um, but there's definitely love letter showing up here. So let's put that one. Um, strength and courage. All right, let's get the overall energy. It's coming to Leo in love. Ooh, overall energy, Leo, you have the Knight of Cups. Okay. I mean, you also have the Ace of Swords. So someone could be expressing their feelings to you. Okay, soon. Um, they could be clearing, clearing um, up something with you, right? But this is definitely wearing your heart on your sleeve, you know, making some some sort of romantic gesture, expressing yourself. So someone may want to tell you how they feel, express themselves to you, Leo. It's coming to Leo in love. This could be coming from a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. What's coming to Leo in love, Leo? I'm hearing that this is someone that you left behind, Leo, for some of you. Okay, you have the Eight of Cups reverse. What's coming to Leo in love? Um, I definitely feel like, Leo, you have somebody who wants to work on their relationship with you. Okay? Or work on their connection with you. What's coming to Leo in love? Leo, what's coming to Leo in love? I feel like someone definitely walked away. Sorry, guys. Give me just a second. I'm going to let my deliver in the gates. If I can find my thing on... Uh, iPad. <laughs> All right. So yeah, guys, um, you're going to have an opportunity to work on an existing connection. And I definitely do feel like this is someone you, you definitely have a history with. You already know. Um, be someone that you met at work as well or do like if you had some type of business with this person or something like that but i do feel like eight of cups of verse someone is coming back okay um maybe they walked away you walked away for others of you maybe you could already be in a relationship and it's gonna be your choice whether you want to further this or not or if you want to continue to work on this relationship okay develop the relationship or take it to a higher level um especially because we do have engagement what's coming to leo in love yeah somebody definitely wants to make you an offer here leo um and you're gonna probably find yourself conflicted on what to tell them okay but somebody wants to either be with you again or start a relationship with you leo that's just the truth king of coins you could be dealing with a taurus uh so far or a water sign specifically pisces we have taurus leo scorpio aquarius pisces energy here so that's what i am feeling um leo tell me about this eight of cups reverse i feel like somebody is they're going to kind of be in their head quite a bit, you know, about taking someone back or starting a new relationship or something like that. Uh, because there is obviously some juggling here. What's the Eight of Cups reverse? The Hierophant. Somebody may like to be single, um, so there may be a dilemma over, you know, <laughs> um, saying bye-bye to their single life, Okay. Three of Swords. Wow. Somebody's really, really, really conflicted. But I do feel like someone is trying to be with somebody. That's the truth. Could be Gemini. Someone's trying to be with somebody. Um, that's what they want. There could be a choice between two people as well, two relationships. Someone's definitely going to find themselves in a dilemma. 
because someone's making an offer very soon, 10 of coins, maybe to start a family, settle down, or like I said, just to be in a relationship, get back together. Yeah, someone's going to be conflicted. Yeah, it's almost like this makes you happy, but at the same time, someone's conflicted here about taking it. And I do feel like this, you know, this person, this freak does have the um, the intention to be loyal, faithful, and, you know, to take care of you or, you know, obviously to just be your rock, be that stable person in your life, even if they weren't before. So um, they're not coming here to screw you up or mess with you. That's the truth. Um, I do feel like this freak more than likely has changed or they have had a change of heart. Maybe it's because this person hurt you in the past or whatever the case may be. Okay. But I do feel like, and I usually don't say that, I do feel like there's been a change in this person. Um, so this person wants to be stable for you. They want to be, you know, that person that you can trust. That's the truth. They do. They do want to do the right thing and honor you. Um, new, old, doesn't matter. You know, they are coming with a good intention, Leo. Um, and they are seriously committed to either getting back together working on things or just starting a relationship with you so i guess it's your choice this is a really good reading for leo because <laughs> i haven't had a good reading like that for leo in a little time um but this is definitely refreshing to see for sure um but just know you're gonna face this this dilemma um and it may take some time for someone to respond to this as to whether they're going to say yes or no. Okay. Tell me more for Leo. So even if they don't respond right away, I guess don't really get discouraged. And you know, it sucks because if you are already in a relationship, Leo, this could be someone else. Um, or maybe if you want to be with somebody in particular and you know that they have somebody Unfortunately, there could be a rejection for that reason. Okay. I have so many lights. This person is definitely taking uh, some action here. Okay. It's coming to Leo and love. It could be Scorpio, Empress, the Star, Aquarius, Nine of Swords. I mean, it's driving someone nuts. They really hope that uh, somebody says yes here. But definitely, um, if you suspect that there's a third party, there could still be, or, you know, at least a third factor or something. Um, but if you're not in a third party, then I would say yes. You know, it, there's nothing wrong with taking this freak back <laughs> or whoever this person is. I mean, they do have the right intention. They do. They do. They want to be the king of coins, um, apparently. So... Leo, what do we have for Leo, please? You have open your heart. It will help you to attract more love. You have communicate, compromise, forgive, and work it out. Let go, make room for the new beginning on its way to you now. So maybe there's a need to forgive, but I don't know. That's up to you. Um, you have air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. You know, or a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You also have patience. Just a few more months. Good things come to those who wait. Um, and then you also have spy. Someone's got their eye on you. You are doing your research. So you're probably wondering if you can trust this freak. Okay. Um, I do think you can trust this person, Leo. Um, however, like I said, please use your discernment. If you know this freak is in a third party, no, don't trust them. But if not, then yeah, they do have a good... Uh, intention for you because i feel like with this hangman this could be you needing to do your research needing to find out make sure this freak really checks out you know and they're not just screwing with you or something all right well get ready to say yes or no leo here it is okay so you have someone who says they won't hurt you okay you have can't be vulnerable you have illusions, so I mean, there could definitely be illusions in someone's head here. They say your love was my drug, 
about to reach out, afraid to love. Someone could just be afraid as well, you know, of just getting into a relationship and just getting hurt, okay? You have Aries, and then you do have I left them, okay? Nervous to talk to you. My heart and soul belongs to you. Yeah, best I ever had. Typing and deleting messages. You have cancer. Tell them you're mine. You have will you marry me? And wine and dine. All right, so that is what we have, Leo. Um, <laughs> just get ready to make that decision because I do feel like someone wants to take it to a higher level with you. Um, I mean, there's, this could even be a proposal for some of you, okay? Um, but yeah, totally, totally up to you, Leo. Totally. Um, you may be juggling something in particular. I'm also hearing that for some of you, maybe this was a long distance relationship and that could be, you know, one of the factors. All right, Leo, so that is what I have for you guys. Thank you so much for tuning in. Talk to you guys soon.